Hey guys, welcome to the Tars 37 Dam Review, and this which is the Funko Pop Spider-Man Far From Home Molten Man. So really cool, really blessed for viewing this today. We got some awesome artwork of Molten Man here, nice queer view in box pop, uh, Spider-Man Far From Home 474. Again, you know, the usual pop stuff. I really like this artwork on the side. We get a larger image of, you know, the usual kind of like a main picture. They're really cool. And then on the back, we have the other version wave. And I've already viewed the upgraded suit Spider-Man and Mysterio. I'm not sure if I'm going to pick up any of the other characters in the wave. I already have a lot of the regular suit, the hero suit. So I don't think I'm going to pick that one up. But I might pick up Hydra Man. Um, so yeah, we'll just see. So here we have Molten Man, and uh, man, he looks really cool. I actually like how they did his head, too. Like, it looks like a solid piece, but it is a bobble, so that's really nice. Um, he has, like, this kind of black and red paint scheme, and it just looks awesome. The black cuts through with the red, or kind of more of an orange, actually, but his face and mouth is really creepy. You can kind of see his teeth, and, like, this orange molten lava just coming down from there looking really cool and kind of weird, if we're being honest. He's got these big, bright yellow eyes. And then um, he has these what looks like uh, kind of like spikes coming out of him. We've seen in some of the other toys and promotional images that kind of looks like parts of a building. So I guess maybe he like uh, that's kind of how he comes out, but kind of looks like more still or something like here it just kind of looks like it's sticks coming out of him but on some of the other stuff we've seen it actually kind of looks like building parts so that's really interesting and I do like the look of it too and uh, if you shine through it it's like it gets really translucent it's kind of hard to show uh, here but yeah I like that feature with it and I like how, again how it kind of just cuts through all around you can see more of the little girder things his hand goes all the way to the ground and can touch it uh, very cool looking again you have like more of that lava stuff and he's actually standing on like a lava Lava Molten Sing just looks really incredible and I like the paint on his toes too and again just more of it's kind of like a coming off of him it's like oozing or something it looks really cool how they did it and kind of disturbing all at the same time so yeah I really like this Molten Man actually I think they uh, did a nice job with that and here's a comparison with Mysterio so uh, as you can see kind of like a little bit of a height difference between them pretty much the same and here's Molten Man with the red and black upgraded suit Spider-Man. So overall, I think this is a really cool Funko Pop. I will say that I'm glad that for Far From Home, we're getting all three of the main villains, supposedly. I remember when Homecoming came out, we only got Vulture. And a lot of times when there's multiple villains, we only get one villain in the main wave. So I really like that they are kind of giving us all of the villains that were made for the movie in this wave. I think that's pretty cool, actually. So yeah, thank you for watching. Please rate, like, and subscribe.